Good old Belladam. Don't mind me, guys. Just going through. Wait, didn't someone say that there was... Wait a minute. Didn't someone say there was like a spell book at Belladam or something that I could get? It was like in a shop. Is it this book right here? Can't interact with it. Never mind. Welcome to Double KO. Alright, maybe not. Somewhere else around here? Hello. Magic spell book? Nope. Nope. Said it was in a store, I think. This store, maybe? Oh, what's that? I can't get back there. Over here, perhaps? Right here? Here? No? No? They did say Belladam, didn't they? If you had ease from here, you'll find a place called the Cave of Spirits. Yeah, yeah. Hey, bro, your swordsman by any chance? Yeah, I guess. Awesome. Why don't you teach me about sword play sometime? I want to get strong. All right, whatever. Oh, wait, wait, wait. An iron treasure chest, but I shouldn't open it without permission. Can I have permission, please? You, like, sell a thing to it? No. You guys mention anything about that treasure chest? Okay. Kind of weird, but whatever. Whoop. Well, if there is a spell around here for me to get, I don't know where it is, so let's just move on. Oh, I have to talk to the village chief for a spell book. Why does he have it? Hello. I see, with Deus gone and Yggdrasil revived, you don't have any reason to be in this time period anymore. Farewell, young ones. I'm glad I got the chance to meet you. Oh, that girl looks like a mage. Here, give her the spell book. I haven't used it in ages. Oh, Cyclone. Cool. People really just be handing out and selling... High-level spells like their candy, huh? Skits? We've done it! We've saved Yggdrasil! It's all thanks to the unicorn, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. How can we express our gratitude to it? Okay, now it's my turn. Let's sail to the ancient city of Thor, shall we? Anything else? Once we journey to Thor, I don't think we'll be returning anytime soon. So I wanted to mention there's something I want to do before we do that. Yay! Let's have a congratulatory Deos butt-kicking party. Denied. But why not? Because no actual butt-kicking took place. We must hurry to my time period and settle this. But still, we drove him out of this world. Come on, guys. Just a little one, please. Time to pack up and move. Onward to Thor. Aw, why are you ignoring me? You people are dead on the inside. Now that we've changed history, how will it affect our time? Yeah, we were probably never born or something. We won't know until we get there. But magic should exist, at least. That's true. Once we defeat Deos for the last time, we'll have nothing to worry about. Yes, especially since Mr. Morrison and Chester will be saved in the process. Mr. Morrison gonna be saved in the process? I'm starting to think Mr. Morrison was never born. Finally, all that's left is to get to Thor. Yeah, but do we know how to get there? Good question. Thor sits at the bottom of the sea. Perhaps we should start by setting sail from Venezia. Uh-huh. Once we reach the water above Thor, just leave the rest to me. Do you realize how easy it would have been for there to have been a skit earlier of them saying, like, we need to find the unicorn? Oh, maybe we should ask around Alvanista. It would have been so simple for them to, like, when they were giving that stupid... Because the skit that you had was just, like, look for the unicorn and literally nothing else. All they had to do was include a line of being, like, maybe we should ask around Alvanista to give a little bit of directioning. Question for stream. What's the best fried food out of onion rings, mozzarella sticks, and french fries? Onion rings are fine. I don't like mozzarella sticks. French fries are a classic, and there are so many different kinds of french fries you can have. Doesn't this make them a paradox? Didn't they destroy the other timeline by doing this? Who knows, man. It's a time travel story invented in 1994. There's no telling what they're gonna do. Yeah. Yeah. 
tough choice. I think I would say onion rings are good, but french fries are better. Onion rings, 100%. Is there anyone who's gonna pick mozzarella sticks over onion rings and french fries? I feel like onion rings and french fries are like an age-old, like... Those are your two options for sides to, like, a standard meal. Specifically in a fast food setting. I feel like you just like fries because they're fries and they're amazing, or you're a person who's like, oh, I love onion rings, which is why you would pick onion rings over anything else, really. That was how my mother was. She was a huge, she loved onion rings, especially from Sonic. Anyone ever gonna fix this place up? <laughs> Making our way to Venezia, don't mind me. I like food, it's even better if I'm not paying for it. Respectable, respectable. Kirby, welcome to stream, how's it going? Whoop. No, 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 kill that one! No, that's, come on! Alright, at least it was only sharpness. Skywalker, thank you so much for subbing a tier 1 for three months. Greatly appreciated. On a three-month streak as well. You missed us uh, beating that awful Deos boss fight and then using the unicorn to save Yggdrasil. Now we're going to the undersea city of <gasps> Thor, not Atlantis. It's called Thor for some reason. To go back to our timeline and see how it changed. I'm particular about my onion rings. Very few places can do them just right. It's hard to mess up french fries or chips for us Brits. So it'd be fries for me, even though I personally prefer onion rings. That's respectable, Lone Wolf. There's something to be said for being like, I like this more than another thing. However, it's easier to mess up the thing I like more. Therefore, I like the other thing that is very rarely messed up. I feel that. I think that's a fair take to have, to be like, oh, like, in, in your case, you like onion rings more, but... It's more likely that, especially probably like a fast food place, would make bad onion rings as opposed to bad fries. So like, go for fries instead, because they're more likely to be done properly. How far are you into this game? How much is left? I have no idea, I've never played the game before. We're like 15 to 16 hours in. Are you the one who can take me to Thor? Alvanista. No, I don't need Alvanista. I bet I need this guy over here who takes me to uh, that, uh, that evil guy who kidnapped Arch's place. I dislike cold fried food. I, I mean, like, most people do. I'm not a big fan of uh, cold fried food either. I like it at least warm, if not hot. Hello. To you guys again, you want to go somewhere? Yeah, the sea above Thor, thank you. One-way fare, including 300 per person? Yeah, it's 60 miles out, that's fair, yeah. How did he make his ship go backwards like that so effectively? This is the place, Captain. Here? You gotta be kidding, are you guys committing suicide? Nope, we're just going for a little trip under the sea. Anyway, we're indebted to you for all you've done for us, Captain. Nah, don't mention it. I mean, what, what do you mean indebted? We paid him. We gave him money. Well, this is it. Come forth, maiden of mist. Maiden of mist. You need it. What do you require of me, my master? Spirit of water, Undine. Please guide us to the ancient city of Thor, which sleeps in the depths of the waters beneath us. As you command. Oh. This bubble shall provide you with safe passage to the sunken metropolis. Step inside. Later, dudes! They sure were a strange bunch. Alright, men, raise the anchor. There it is. Totally not Atlantis. Whoa. 
Wow. Have we truly reached the bottom of the sea? Well, the sea's above us, not below us. Hey, don't go wandering off now. It's hard to tell from here, but it seems the city is surrounded by walls sturdy enough to withstand the water pressure. Can there really be a time-traveling device here? At the very least, we've just discovered that the literature about Thor's sinking was true. If the finest mages of the world have been right about that much, then why start doubting them now? Let's get looking, I guess. Look at these fancy machines. Okay. Oh, save point, huh? All right. Yo, here's a question to piggyback off of the onion ring fry thing. What's your favorite kind of fry, chat? What's like your What's like your top three fries? Because fries come in so many different kinds. I haven't had them in ages, but boy howdy, I love steak fries. Steak fries, waffle fries, and then like your standard fast food fries are kind of my go-to. I love them. I haven't had steak fries or waffle fries in a hot minute. What's this little gadget? Lots of buttons, switches, and other little things. I wonder what the little slit in the middle is for. Identification card? Uh, hi there. Do you require supplies? I'm good. Come back anytime. Alright, thanks, bro. That was weird. Curly fries aren't bad. Some people say in curly fries. I don't know, I feel like curly fries are just inferior waffle fries, personally. I'd rather just have waffle in that case. Like, steak fries and normal fries are distinctive enough from waffle fries for me to be like they're all great in their own way. But like, curly fries, I'm just like, I feel like I'm eating a worse version of waffle fries. But I also haven't had curly fries in a long while. It's rusted shut too bad. Let's blow it open. This screen effect of the water over top is... Gonna get on my nerves pretty quickly. It makes it, like, kind of hard to see what's going on sometimes. Anything in here? There a key card in here I can get, maybe? Oh, right here. Hey, what's this? Looks like a card. What's with the weird pattern on the back, though? Do the ancients play card games, too? Yeah, on motorcycles, even. Probably won't be of any use, but hey, it might make a nice souvenir. Yeah, I'm gonna take the card, dumb idiots. This is what we need. There is not an Arby's near me. I have not had... I Have I ever eaten in an Arby's? I might have eaten in an Arby's like twice in my life. There's no Arby's near me. What's this little gadget? Yeah, 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 yeah. Slit in the middle is for. Put in the card. Huh, it doesn't look like we can go anywhere else. What the heck should we do? I just got an idea. Let me see that card we just found. Nope. ID card authentication. Authenticized, whatever. Security system disengaged. Let's go. Gamer moment. Who said that? There's someone behind the door. Uh, guys, that didn't exactly sound human. Also, yeah, curly fries are spicy a lot of the time. I don't like spicy fries. I don't want my fries to be spicy. I just want to dip them in some ketchup and that's that. Or drizzle ketchup over them. Provided I have napkins on hand. Door only opens if you slip a card into this thing. That's a weird system. I kind of like it. Hello? Anyone home? Common room. Uh. It's locked. 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 Can I just... Okay. I wanted to, wanted to walk by, but all right. Look at these. Okay. All right, no lightning needed. Hey, there's the cyclone. Yo, cyclone is sick. I'm so sharp. No, my rising phoenix, you interrupted it. Please let me Rising Phoenix you. Yo, great Cyclone timing. Let's go. Yo, Cyclone is insanely good. What the heck? Kaka! 
Keep him on the ground. There we go. Now we're talking. Are you team 4400R or 3000R? Uh, I'm 4400R because the 3000Rs are already dead. Alright, that wasn't too bad. The enemies I fought looked nothing like the giant buff genie guy. Wow, that was no experience whatsoever. Okay. Oh, it's because it wasn't the giant buff genie dude. It was just a random encounter. Jan! Weren't you like a love interest of Michael Scott in the office or something? You, uh, you got really buff. Stab, 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 stab. Oh, you can cast, huh? Okay. Honestly, thought this would be turn-based combat? Nah. Tales of uh, real-time combat has always been its thing. It just used to be 2D instead of 3D. The 2D is... Uh, 2D is not as good as the 3D, though. Empty. Also empty. All right, I'm seeing a pattern. Oh, the common key, my favorite. No cast, that was Jim? No, it wasn't. What version of The Office were you watching? Hello? He skipped like that. Yeah. Merman and Living Sword? Yeah. Yo, mermen look awful in this game. They're full-on fish people. They don't even look like dudes. There's no man to this at all. It's just a fish with arms. Dude, these living swords are intense. Oh, Arch died. Yo, these swords are a problem? Clark died too. Hold up, this is a problem. Uh, life bottle probably arch here. Burn. This is rough. I wish we had treats. Trying to keep mint up. I'm trying to hold these guys back so they can cast. There we go, Cyclone, please kill something. These things will not die. Help. Okay, I killed a sword. Oh dear. Help, 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 help. For the record, I hate this. Arch, use an apple gel on me? This is, uh, this is pretty awful, huh? Now. Oh, wait, Clark is all the way over there? Hold up, get up, Clark. Oh, good, you're dead. All right, get behind me. Get behind me. Die. Mint, please heal or something. All right, you're dead. Thank goodness. Well, get back up. What's your face? Zap. Ow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Stun lock it. Stun lock the living sword. Okay. Alright. That, uh. Okay, better experience at least. I once again want to reiterate that I hate combat in this game where you have enemies on either side of you because it becomes a nightmare. 
Like, I feel like there's really no good option for how to deal with enemies when they're on either side of you. It would be a lot easier if I had one other physical combatant instead of three mages. But, you know, what are you, what are you gonna do? There've gotta be... I know there's one other on my thumbnail, the thumbnail I got for this series. It has another girl on it, I think who I assume is supposed to be a main character that we haven't encountered yet. Like, I don't think we're near the end of the game, but we've at least got to be, like, halfway through this game by now, right? You would think? Or maybe around the halfway point? She's not going to have a lot of screen time. Are the other three controlled by AI? What, the other, like, Mint, Parth, and Arch? Yeah, you only control one character at a time. Let's try the common key. Woo! Ooh, okay. God's breath, whatever that does. I think Thor is the halfway point of the game? Really? What on earth else is this game gonna have that's actually gonna be interesting? But can I not? Does the common key only work once? How do I proceed then? <laughs> 